killer went through my files first before shooting Mr. Faith. And then put the files back in numerical order. Oh. Maybe Mr. Buddy Faith was the one looking at the files and then someone came in and killed him. Oh shit, yeah. And then the files were put back in numerical order, I guess. Exactly. And then proceeded to shoot the victim. But why would someone kill a man then look through your files one more time? Puzzling indeed. The files were thrown into disarray twice. Once before and once after the crime. But why? As soon as we can start pulling up to a stopping point, I am passing out. Yeah, that's fair. My, uh, I'm on a medication for my restlessness, and uh -huh. it just, it just, it's supposed to help. See in the teeth? Oh my god, I have, I sleep so good with it, but like, I have to take it like two to three hours before bedtime. Gotcha. And like, it is just wiping me out. Cause I actually have like a pretty severe case of legit restless leg syndrome. Mm, so is my wife. <laughs> no. Yeah, not like the fun, like, oh, I'm just a little bit jittery or whatever, or a little bit restless. Like, it actually affects my sleep. To the point where, like, I get anxious. Like, I was having insomnia and was spiking my anxiety. So, I'm on a medication, and it just wipes me out. <laughs> so, I am, pass I am passing out. So, whenever we can call it uh, a good stopping point, I'm, I'm down for that. Sounds good. I think this is a thing here. Yeah. This. Wh what? Gum ho. Where, where gum ho. Why does it, it say gumshoe on there in blood? It says gum ho. <laughs> yeah, the S is missing. <laughs> oh God, Ashley, your breath is stinky. Oh, stinky girl. <coughs> also, Her breath is freshman. Ashley's breath has been gross. I'd say it. Uh... <laughs> I'd say it's an incredibly incriminating evidence. Evidence! Oh, ho, ho. Oh, ho, ho, baguette! <laughs> no, Ashley, don't leave me. You sound weird, I'm leaving. Yes. <laughs> Literally like, okay, bye. Indicative of criminal activity, indeed. No, wait! There's gotta be some mistake! Yeah, why would Gumshoe write his own name? Like, this is... <laughs> yeah. Mr. Sir, like Gumshoe, you did it. Help me! Say something, sir! It appears that one of my files was stolen. Is that all, sir? What about me and my situation? Is no situation, because literally nobody would write their own name to incriminate themselves. Yeah, no. This is what the killer was really after. Stolen file data jotted down in my organizer, in my brain. Bum, bum, bum. Investigation complete. Ooh, hey, look, I got health back. Hell yeah. Looks like Jim was able to leave us the name of his killer in the end. And this most important message managed to reach us. I'm telling you, it wasn't me. You can't be terribly pleased to hear that your beloved partner is a, is a guilty party. Healthy. If you are going to accuse Detective Gumshoe of being the culprit, I sincerely hope you have proof to back it up. Jim's words. They are more than enough, wouldn't you say? If that's how you want to play it, then at least allow me to understand your reasoning. You check out Jim's hands to make sure that I mean did because this like <laughs> Mia's case was the same thing where they used her finger to write Maya's name in blood right all right you got it mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I don't like this one bit there's something strange about this man's attitude and his hair it curls over and up his band it is very stylish. Ha oh, oh, ha oh, ha, I am French. Roger Federer is my man. <laughs> there must be some sort of logic, logic waiting for me to, to dig out. 
you, Mr. Edgeworth. What, what are you going to do? What I always do in court. I'm going to cross-examine him. One way or another, I'll expose the flaw in his logic and with his technique. Whoa! How do you do that? C can you explain it to me, sir? No! Oh, I can skip it. Should I skip it? Uh... I feel like skipping this is just skipping the tutorial. Yeah. We know how to do this. Mr. Portsman, if you are ready. Wah. If you don't have time, you could just say so. I, I clicked the I don't have time one. He just chose to say nothing. <laughs> Mr. Portsman's logic. Detective Gamsu, you stole Jim's gun from him and shot him in... shot him dead. Further? 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 You messed up the files to make it look like you had committed theft instead. That's when you moved Jim's body that was sitting in front of the bookshelf. Thanks to that, you didn't notice the bloody letter... the bloody letters his body was hiding. And it will be by his final words that you will be brought judge. You will be brought to justice. <laughs> so I'm working on it. And it will be by his final words that you will be brought to justice. Just, justice, justice. <laughs> you intend to argue that the victim's dying <laughs> message points to his killer. Every time somebody makes an argument, and Edgeworth is just standing there like. <laughs> Seriously, I get very intimidated. <laughs> yeah, like he has this kind of death glare, it's, and it's not even with him trying, and that's what makes it so fun. Yeah, he's just like, <sighs> I can hear Jim's voice, and he's calling for his killer's arrest. Hmm. Are you sure you're not mishearing his words, Mr. Portsman? There's no way Detective Gumshoe is the culprit here. I will find the flaw in his, in this man's logic. Flaw. And expose it with credible evidence. Rebuttal. Don't have to reread this because it's the same thing, so. Stole Yim's gun. Shot him dead. Uh -uh. Okay, further. <sighs> okay, hold on. I'm gonna press this. Hold it! You know, there's something I've been meaning to ask. Huh? What is it? Why do you call the victim Jim? When clearly his name is Buddy Faith. That's the stupid yeah. reasoning. Isn't it obvious? Jim is the perfect name for my companion. Jacques and Jim. Don't those two names go together like peanut butter and jam? Uh, but Jim isn't even close to the guy's real name. That is not what matters. Well, Jacques and Buddy just sounds off somehow. Besides, he was the third of a bunch of guys I decided to nickname Jim. Oh, that's fucked. Huh? That's just fucked that he would do that. Yeah. I don't care to know your name. I'm gonna call you Jim. You're just Jim to me. Yeah, he talks about him like he was his pet. Ugh. Further? Oh, that's, well, yeah. Really messed up files to make it look like you had committed theft instead. That's when he moved Jim's body that was sitting up in front of the bookshelf. Thanks to that, you didn't notice the bloody letters. Hmm. Uh, hmm. Just press all of it. Right. Hold it. Body was covered. Oh, you sure? That's how he missed it. Okay. Uh, but it doesn't take much for your detective to miss something. Oh, dick move. Oh, shit. Who do you think you are? You know nothing about me, pal. Yeah, 
can't say I disagree with him on that part. Why don't you say something, sir? <gasps> N not you too, Mr. Edgeworth! Despite his lack of attention to detail, I don't believe the detective to be the culprit. Nobody could have overlooked the bloody flames. And I can prove it with evidence. I couldn't ask for a better setup. For the game finishing spike. I wonder if there's something here. Oh, boop. Uh, one of the files written in blood was stolen by the culprit. So they would have noticed. Yeah. Taking it. So yeah, this is what we're gonna present, I think. Yeah, and if not this, then the one that's um, done on the statement where it's talking about uh, you made it look like he was committing theft. Yeah. Objection! Aw, oh, yeah, <laughs> that was an objection. Perhaps you're not aware, Mr. Portsman, but there is a serious flaw in your logic. <laughs> Bringing a bit of the courtroom into this, I see. Problem? I'm game. I can't help but find it odd. Excuse me? Excusez-moi? Excusez-moi? Odd that a fellow prosecutor would be brought down by the power of his own office. What the hell are you talking about? Oh, you're shocking, I get it! <laughs> if you have the time to laugh, then you have the time to take another, closer look at this. You still not see? If not, may I direct your attention to the missing file? What? That's impossible! Très impossible! What's impossible, Mr. Portsman? Um, eh, uh, nothing. The files on the shelf are all about a certain case. When the killer went to take the file after murdering the partner. I highly doubt they could have missed the bloody letters written on the spines. It's possible that they could have taken the file before committing the murder. No. No. No, because the gumshoe is missing. Yeah, it's, it's pretty obvious that the file was stolen after it was written, dude. The missing letters in the detective's name, where the how where the file should be, is proof. Yeah, I mean the S is gone, and there's only half a. Um, if Detective Gumshoe really was the culprit of this case, I highly doubt that even he could overlook his own name written in blood on the files. Especially as a detective who can't stand the sight of blood. Ah, <gasps> le gas. Yes, le gasp. Which means... What exactly? What does that make this dying message? It makes it the work of a criminal intent on tampering with the crime scene. Uh, le ellipses. <laughs> le ellipses. <laughs> <laughs> That's so low! I can't believe the criminal tried to pin this whole thing on me, sir! I'm gonna get him, sir! You'll see! I'm gonna have them under arrest in no time! Well, Mr. Portsman? <laughs> Brilliant! Absolutely splendid! Logic deserving of Olympic gold! Oh, fuck off with your medal. I know, right? <laughs> I appreciate the praise, but it doesn't change the fact that your reasoning is flawed. You win some, and then you lose some. So it is how life goes. I'm glad everyone's so cheery, even though I feel more dead than alive. <laughs> ah, but you know, it really is a shame. I really didn't want to bring this up, however. What? What is it this time? Are you still after me, pal? <sighs> humor, me humor me for a second. As the key to this office. That would be me. 
I'm a just, Mr. Edwards, I just proved that I'm innocent, pal. Oh. Oh, nice. Okay. I am showing off on my pecs. That is absolutely right, and I acknowledge your innocence. Then why do you, do I sense that you still have something to say? What? I am so, I am so cool. I flash my jacket over and over when I was thinking. Did you know there is person with the key to this office? One other person. Hey, you there? Yes, sir. What is it, <laughs> sir? Should you kindly fetch and escort that lovely young lady here for me? Who? A uh, lady? The girl is a member of this building's security. Think, think of her as a serial witness. S security? Did you say security? No! Stop it, pal! Don't! Uh, mm. What's wrong with him after all? What's wrong with him all of a sudden? Oh God! Who is that? I think I, it's, I think it's. Needs no... I don't know who that is. 